Can I just say I find it to be funny that we didn't even try to do no, this? No, no. But we didn't either. Them out. They got yeah, the we didn't try and be we Valentine's Day. Day. Yeah. Hey everyone, welcome to the BravoTV.com interview oh, stage. Right. I am Darren Karp, and we have the BFF stage going on right here. And according to them, they did not plan this and they didn't mean to coordinate. No. But from the Real Housewives of Atlanta, I've got the lovely Candy Burris up hey. here. And equally, the OG. equally as worldwide, I got Kenya Moore as well. Hey. Over here. And we've got some summer and winter fun behind us here today, although they are giving a little color block, start of the rainbow amazingness. We're giving Valentine's Day. We're giving Valentine's Day. I've got the incredible Paige DeStorbo on stage with us right now. And the one and only Amanda. I mean, my God, she looks great in the red. Or how badly are you sweating right now, Amanda? Not at all. Wow, all right, well. It's gonna get turned up in here. <laughs> Paige and Amanda, I wanna start with you. How does it feel to be on the stage with like these iconic women? I mean, these are the I'm shaking. housewives. Are you shaking? <laughs> Atlanta is tough. Aww. It's tough. Oh, thank you. Yeah. It's peak. Yeah. Thank you. Have you ever met them before? I met Candy on Friday and I have not met Kenya, but I've seen her all around and I've been too scared to go up to her. <laughs> Kenya, can you believe well, you're intimidating to some people? Um, like beautiful, like oh. beautiful. Beautiful. I mean, Kenya, you're so easy and nice to talk to. I, know, I, I always know. say I'm that. Say hello. Yes. <laughs> what have you been your highlights at BravoCon this weekend, Candy? What's been going on? What have you been looking forward to? Well, I mean, the weekend is over now. So you mean, what did I? Oh, it's over. Oh, I part? can leave now. My day is the last day. Yes. But my favorite part was winning the family game. You know. Yes, she did. I hosted like that to one. Win. <laughs> There. Well, Watch What Happens Live is really, really fun as well. Yeah. Kenya, what about you? I mean, just going everywhere and hearing people say, Kenya Moore Heritage! Kenya Moore <laughs> You can't say the name without that now. I know! It's yeah. so crazy. It's so crazy. But I just did the meet and greet where you take the photos with the fans, and just that was the highlight, too. So emotional, the things that people come and say. It just really touches my heart, and it just actually started to make me cry. So I was like, oh, this is too much. You know it what? Was I, too much. It was too much. <laughs> what I love about your friendships is that we've only got to see them establish on camera. Amanda and Paige, when did you guys know that you guys were going to be BFFs? Because I feel like we saw that moment happen. I know. Mostly I know surrounding exactly your wedding, when. I will say. But yeah. when did you know? The moment we met. Yeah, I knew like, we weren't even in the house and we went out to lunch together. We ordered the same thing. Oh, and then I texted my friend. I was like, I just had the best like girl date ever. And I, I think I'm going to be her best friend forever. Oh, my God. We hit it off instantaneously. Yeah. Like we had the best time. We couldn't stop talking. I love a girl date. You know, I love a girl date. <laughs> uh, Candy and Kenya, you know, you guys have a great friendship that I love. Absolutely. But there's constantly other housewives that are trying to get in between you yes. and try and break you guys apart. How do you guys say such good friends, knowing that you might be friends with people that might not like your bestie? Yeah. That is kind of crazy. I mean, I don't know. Why do people try to always pit us against each other? I don't know. Like, they always try to make us make an issue. Like, you'll see them online with Kenya's not your friend or, or she's right. not your friend. And why did she say that? Why didn't she do that? It's like... They're we're jealous. good, like stop, like yeah. get out of our relationship, like we're okay. We found a great way, like our, we have great communication, you know, whenever we have an issue or whatever, we just have a great way of just saying how we feel yeah. and right. moving past it. Like we don't hold on to anything with each other. And trusting each other. What about you two? I feel like people are always trying to get in between you guys as well. I get people are <laughs> always, like, yeah, like all the time. They're like, Paige isn't your real friend. I'm like, Paige. well, we're texting right now, so we're fine. <laughs> because like we don't post every time we hang out. They're like, they're not friends. I'm like, she's literally sitting next to me. <laughs> if, if Craig and Kyle aren't getting along, do we side with each other and we just screw the men? Yeah. What are we hate doing? Them. We, we hate them. them. Yeah. Okay. You know, Paige, you're very close with your former Summer House castmate, Hannah Burner. Yes. Of course. And Amanda, you're no longer friends with her. I'm sure these ladies have a lot to say about that. How do you maintain both friendships knowing your closest friends aren't really 
friends with each other? Honestly, it's not like we're in high school and we have to see each other in homeroom and like sit at the same lunch table. So when I'm with Amanda, it's a very different relationship. Like she's not talking about Hannah. When I'm with Hannah, she's not talking about Amanda. It's honestly a lot easier than people right. think. Right. Tell her she has to choose. Yeah. <laughs> Now, do you guys have this problem at all in Atlanta? I mean, no, I we know... usually don't like the same people at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> that is very true. She is, she's the one that would be like, you, you, oh my God, I cannot believe you're talking to her. Oh, she, she is not your friend, okay? <laughs> she's not your friend. She loves doing that. Can you be honest, how happy were you when uh, Candy and Marlo weren't getting along this season? Did it make you happy? Did you want to see them be friends? Pretty much. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, yeah. <laughs> uh, Paige and Amanda, has there ever been any mystery gossip that's gone unsolved in the summer or winter house? We find it all out. Mystery? No. No. No, it's There's never. There's no mystery for <laughs> yeah. us. Yeah. Uh, Candy and um, Candy and Kenya, what did you both think of Marlo getting a peach this season? We think two different things. I want to hear both of these yeah, opinions. Two separate then. opinions. Okay, Candy. Well, I guess I'll say I'll start. <laughs> well, I felt well, like her, her mouth, her mic went out. Oh, her mic's not working. Yeah, her mic's not working. It's so <laughs> weird. Well, I felt like Marlo needed to finally get a peach. She had been there for so long. But we never like really get to, like she gets the benefit of hanging with, that, with us without having to do all the extra work of letting you see our personal life. And I felt like we should be able to dig into her personal life. Yeah. I felt like we need to know what's going on with her mom. Now I still haven't found out what's going on in her relationships yet. Like now that we need to push that button. Like where are the boyfriends at? Where is the man? <laughs> we need a bone like, collector. Somebody, Cause she's always coming after her man. Right. <laughs> but like, I, I felt like it was needed. Kenya? I still don't know who you're talking about. <laughs> You've never heard of her. You've never heard of her. Uh, what has your BFF said about you in a confessional that hurt your feelings when you watched an episode? <laughs> I know the Atlanta women have got a lot of arsenal on here. I don't think we have one. I mean, no. Anything she says about Kyle is true, so it doesn't <laughs> upset me. Craig. <laughs> I, I know Kenya? Okay, so it was eventually cleared up, but she was talking about me being a hoe and comparing it to like a movie where I was in a menage a trois and I'm like, I was acting. <laughs> so I was like, what are you doing, Candy? Like you're co-signing this. Are you insane? No, 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 no. See, she said I was co-signing, Marla. That's what she said. And I was like, that is not true. Right. What they did was I said what I said, like made my joke, and they cut away to Marlo. I'm like, me and Marlo never even discussed it. They cut to Marlo to make you feel like we were aligned together. That is not what happened. I feel like Candy's not the type to use a menage a trois against anybody, is all I'm saying. She's, you know what I mean? Yeah. She's oh, sex hey, positive. I'm not using it against her. I'm fine with whoever she wants to sleep with. Yeah, that's I right. I was just saying, don't talk bad about me. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's right. Like, don't say anything never, bad about me. I would never co-sign someone calling you a hoe. Like, never. Like, I know you're sex positive. But I didn't call you a hoe. It seemed like it. Because they <laughs> cut away to Marlo. The perfect way about this is just call it Kyle a hoe. Because we're all going to agree that Kyle's a hoe. <laughs> call Kyle and Craig hoes and the girls will be fine with it. All right, will you guys play a little game with me? Yes. All right, right, here's some foam fingers. Pass it out. You might have to put the mic down. you got to put on the foam fingers now. All right, this one's good. It's time to see if these BFFs are on point. Put on the foam fingers uh, and close your eyes. No cheating, ladies, okay? For each statement I read, point at who it most applies to, either yourself or your BFF, okay? okay. Keep those eyes closed, Amanda and Candy. All right, who's more generous when it comes to compliments? Close those eyes, Candy. Okay, very different answers here, all right. Who's more generous when it comes to gifts? I... <laughs> you can open your eyes after to see, just to see. All right, everyone, there's Paige, and you two are very complimentary of each other. I love that. <laughs> Who's better at remembering birthdays and other important dates? Ah, uh, remembering, that's a tough one. 
Yeah. All right, we're all great candy, and you guys, you guys are each complimenting each other. I like this a lot. Gone with the wind, fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> Who's most likely to spend the most money on their credit card in a day? All right, well, Paige and Amanda agree it's Paige. Yes, yes. Oh, uh, they're both most like it is. Uh, Kenya's, Kenya's, you're owning it. You're only it. <laughs> I own it. <laughs> Who's the better dancer? Oh, um, that's easy. <laughs> okay, Amanda and Kenya are breaking it down on the dance floor. Here's a good one. Who's funnier? Kenya, okay, and you guys are diplomatic in the Bye, back. Paige. What a compliment. Amanda's jokes never make it into the episode, ever, yeah. but she is hilarious. We do know she can make a joke. She yes. can make a joke. Who's better at clapping back at online trolls? Oh. Definitely Paige, definitely Kenya. We should all just point to Kenya, I think, for that one. I feel like the whole audience is going to point to you. Who checks their social media more? Oh, wait, who, well, who checks their social media oh, more? I know you're not playing. You have Google alerts. I do oh, not. No, I only have a Google alert on myself once a day. Checking social media, you have like 50 million followers and you're always <laughs> online. Are you kidding me? Okay, okay, okay. I mean, she's serious? I do check social media, but she care more about what the comments say. Like That's not what she asked. Like, <laughs> <laughs> You are always posting on social media. Are you kidding hey, okay, me? Okay, Friendships okay. may be ending on the stage tonight. <laughs> I apologize. Okay, last one. Who's got a fatter bank account? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's easy. Oh, Paige, you both agree it's each other. Everyone agrees it's Candy Everyone Burris, though. Hey, baby. It's, <laughs> it's Candy Burris, for sure. Yes. Candy Burris owns all of our bank accounts. I want Candy yes. Burris's bank account. <laughs> Ladies, thank you so much for Thank being here. Thanks you. for being best friends. Guys, keep watching BravoTV.com for more interviews with some Bravo Lebs at BravoCon.